the opening night of Lady in the Dark, Gertrude Lawrence's return to the musical theater. The show got off to a great start, but the big question mark was the final dream sequence. There had been rumors of difficulties and trouble. No one knew what to expect. Can you give us any reason why you refuse to make up your mind? Yes, I can. There once was a girl named Jenny Whose virtues were varied and many Excepting that she was inclined Always to make up her mind And Jenny points a moral with which you cannot quarrel as you will find. Jenny? Jenny? mind up when she was three she herself was going to trim the christmas tree christmas eve she lit the candles tossed the tapers away little jenny was an orphan on christmas day poor jenny bright as a penny her evil would be hard to find she lost one dad and mother a sister and a brother but she would make up her mind Jenny made her mind up when she was 12 That into foreign languages she would delve But at 17 to Vasa it was quite a blow That in 27 languages she couldn't say no Poor Jenny, bright as a penny Her equal would be hard to find To Jenny I'm beholden Her heart was big and golden But she would make up her mind Jenny made her mind up at 22 To get herself a husband was the thing to do So she got herself all dolled up in her satins and furs And she got herself a husband, but he wasn't hers Oh, Jenny, bright as a penny Her equal would be hard to find Deserved a bed of roses, but history discloses that she would make up her mind. Jenny made her mind up at 51 that she would write her memoirs before she was done. The very day her book was published, history relates. There were wives who shot their husbands in some 33 states. Oh, Jenny, bright as a penny, she's got no equal. It's true she could give cars and spadies to many other ladies, but she would make up her mind. Jenny made her mind up at 75 That she would live to be the 
oldest woman alive. But gin and rum and destiny, they play funny tricks. And for Jenny, kick the bucket at 76. <laughs> like so many before them and so many still to come, witnessed a theatrical miracle. They saw Gertrude Lawrence, star 